Lawmakers want to change Louisiana's public records law. But as Sabrina Wilson reports, opponents say government transparency is a part of democracy. Like the federal government, Louisiana allows the public to request and gain access to government records. But in the legislature, there are bills that would water down the public records law. A portion of SB 482 by Senator Heather Cloud makes an exception to the public records law for any records reflecting advisory opinions, recommendations, and deliberations that are part of a process by which governmental decisions and policies are made. People in favor of transparency don't like it. Limiting the public records like this lets the government operate in secret, and it erodes that public trust. This bill creates a huge carve out to our state public records law. Attorney Malia Serrato is a Sunshine Fellow with the First Amendment Law Clinic at Tulane. This bill would essentially exempt all government records at all levels of government, from your city, your town, your parish, to your state. So. This isn't just to the governor. Dillard University political analyst Dr. Robert Collins says it's bad from a public policy and transparency standpoint. This law, if passed, would almost certainly automatically uh, be challenged on First Amendment grounds. Another bill, HB 461 by Representative Stephen Jackson, recently won State House approval. It says records in the custody of local governments pertaining to an active negotiation related to proposed economic development shall be confidential if such confidentiality is requested in writing. This will add uh, local and parish governments to that statute. This is already existing statute. Uh, LED already is um, exempt under the statute as well as ports. In the House committee, there was pushback. To you that the local governments are not the economic development districts, they're not the ports, and it's not LED. They are the folks who are signing the bus contracts and making sure that people have uh, appropriate housing and things of that nature, and that those are the kind of records that people should be able to check up on their government for. This bill definitely shrouds local governments in secrecy. Two other bills would require people requesting public records to be Louisiana citizens and to provide information verifying their age and ID. We have a case in which a father of a man was murdered in Louisiana and he sought access to those public records about the death of his son. Under these two bills, that man who is a Missouri resident He's just looking for answers about Louisiana's handling of the, his child's death. This bill would tell that grieving father he has no right to see those investigative records. Uh, not just in the media, but anybody that cares about transparency and the First Amendment is going to be uh, opposed to these laws. I'm Sabrina Wilson, Fox 8 Local First. You requested a comment from the governor and each of the lawmakers sponsoring the four bills, but so far have not heard back.